Buongiorno, I'm Giordina. I'm a professional credentialed Italian language teacher and I spent nine years of my life living in Italy. Let's talk about love. Many people think that Italian, Italiano is the language of love, la lingua dell'amore. Well, let's see how you say I love you in Italiano. First of all, the verb amare is to love. And also, love itself is amore. So, amore is love, and amare is the verb to love. Now, to say I love you, there's two very, very distinct ways to say I love you. Whereas in English, it's I love you, and then I love my mom, I love my car, I love my job, I love ice cream, I love my dog. Not in Italian, not in Italian. Ti amo is I love you for a romantic partner. The serious stuff, the big L, right? For everybody else, your family, your friends, your children. It's ti voglio bene. Ti voglio bene. Which we would also translate to I love you, but it's more like, if you were to do a literal translation, I want well for you or I care about you. So how would you say I love ice cream? Well, you'd say il gelato mi piace tanto. Meaning ice cream pleases me very much. So, there are other variations of ti voglio bene. Now, if you wanted to say I really, really care about you, you'd say ti voglio tanto bene. Ti voglio tanto bene. Which you could call I love you very much or I really, really care about you. Now, little interesting side note that you can take away with you is there is an abbreviation that people use in Italian for text messages or Facebook messages for ti voglio bene and it's ti vi bi. I'll write that here. Ti vi bi. Ti voglio bene. Now, if you want to up the ante a little bit and you want to say ti voglio tanto bene, your text message abbreviation would be ti vi ti bi. So you could use these in your text messages, you could use these in your Facebook messages. And that's how to say I love you in Italian. Have fun.